Good morning, good afternoon, or good night, or whatever time it may be in your part of the world. My name is Mr. John Wayne, and I am a variety gamer. I play everything from the Fallout franchise all the way to the Soulsborne series. Welcome, everybody, to another episode of my Let's Play of The Rise of the Ronin. I hope you're all doing well. I know that I am. And today, we're going to finish the main quest called A New Path. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get started. All the men of Choshu want is to change Japan for the better. Damn it, we all want the same thing. For it to come to this. This way! I hope Shinsaku is all right. Shintaro, too. You'll be fighting alongside the Choshu. The Choshu survivors have fled to that temple. I don't know if Shinsaku is there, but we need to get inside and help them. I'd like to avoid fighting the Shogun's men, but that might not be easy. Are you prepared? Do you really think we can avoid fighting? I hope so, but I don't know. The Shogun's forces... Especially the Shinsengumi have eyes and ears everywhere. Then I suppose we should get going. Should have known you'd be ready for anything. If they find out we helped the Choshu now, they may well brand us as traitors. But we need to act now, before it's too late. Come on, let's make our move. Let's see. We haven't used this guy yet. This is the guy with like the gun on his back. He looks pretty cool. Um, actually, let me come over here. Oh, I don't have any growth items. It'll be a pleasure working together. I'll give it everything. They must be hiding somewhere. Root them out and kill them all. <laughs> mm, that's quite a trick. Hopefully this mission isn't too long. Seems like every time we go to a new region, we get a fairly long um, mission. Oh, damn it. There's a ladder up there. Wonder if there's a way up. Looks like there used to be. Very nice. Oh, 
trying to be sneaky. Oh, what's over here? <coughs> Nothing. Well, I guess there's something. Ooh, some wood. <laughs> what are you doing, Ryoma? <laughs> Very nice. Shooting at us. Do not overdo it. Try not to. Man, he throws bombs. That's awesome. Good lord. God, I can never get the parrying down in this game, man. Like, I think the combat is pretty fun, but I think there's too many different styles that when it comes to parrying, it just doesn't work very well. And maybe it's just me, but that's just how I feel. Another person on the roof. <laughs> Somebody shoot me from somewhere. I'm like, man. I'm sorry about that. Should be sorry about that. I was hoping that there wouldn't be anybody on the roof. We could have a fight without being shot in the back, but that did not happen. Rescue the Choshu retainers. Strong, please. You must help Takasugi. Last I saw, they had driven him into the main hall. There's one retainer. Oh, 
we should uh, probably heal ourselves. Takasugi is in a bad way too. He can't hold out for long. We have a couple of optional things to do in this area. I thought there was a place we could, yeah, over here. I mean, you're dead. This isn't much, but I, I want you to have it. I don't know what he gave us. It didn't really pop up on screen that I could see. Oh wow, I could have come over here. Instead of going that way, I could have went up here, came around. Probably had a little bit of an easier time taking some of the enemies out. Oh well, you live and you learn, right? Need to rescue one more retainer and kill one more formidable foe. I think we can do that. Got another flag so soon? Not something you see too often. Oh, that's the ladder from before. Well, what's the point of that? Okay, I don't know. That doesn't make sense at all. to interfere. If so, I will not huh? hold back. <laughs> Impressive. <laughs> Get him! You do not have me yet. Your style is quite interesting. If I might give it a try. Oh. Come on, guys, what are you doing? Watch out. Yeah, watch out. Like, my allies are doing absolutely nothing. Wow, you finally just started shooting somebody. Well, good thing I healed, right? You do not disappoint. I was thrilling. I like this technique. I feel alive. You're so very alive. <laughs> Qu 
Kondo would be grateful for fighters with your skills. Perhaps you might consider... No, never mind. You did well to stop him. Now, let's get Shinsaku out of here. Want to be dangerous out there? We should be able to get him to the Choshu's Kyoto estate. With all of this going on, I'm hoping the defenses there have thinned. He's in trouble if we don't get him to a doctor right away. Come on, let's hurry. If it wasn't for you, I would have been done for. You're looking a lot healthier now. I seriously thought it was the end for me. But thanks to you, I live to tell the tale. It was Oreo who saved you, really. <laughs> I didn't know you were such an expert. The expert is my father. All I did was follow his instructions. To you and your father, I can never thank you enough. If you had not come, many lives would have been lost. And I must say, your arrival was a very nice surprise. I never thought this would be my chance to see you again. <laughs> it seems too good to be true, doesn't it? Clearly, fate has something in store for the two of you. Uh, I... I don't know about that. <laughs> uh, that aside, uh, what happened to Katsura? Do you know where he is? No. He vanished after the incident they get in. But then this letter arrived here just this morning. Let's see here. I'm in Kamogawa. Your time has come. Rise as one. And do you think this is Katsura? I can't say for certain. But anyone who would know Master Shon's last words must have seen his end. Maybe we should head for Kamagawa River. You're right. That way we'll know for sure. Katsura's the man in charge. If he doesn't show his face soon, it's going to be hard to keep everyone in line. Regretfully, I would have to leave this one up to you. I'm still not too steady on my feet. Also, it feels like I'm coming down with a cold. <coughs> mm, not a problem. We'll head there as soon as we're ready. There's a longhouse you can use in Kyoto. Rest up there. Once you're all set, join me in Kamogawa. Be careful, Ryoma. I will. Just look after Shinsaku, won't you? I thought he died, though. Okay. That's interesting. So it looks like we got quite a few things to do. A photograph studio. Let's do this one. <laughs> We're right next to this one, so that shouldn't be too hard. Hey. Ah, what rotten timing. Just as we drop by, 
I have to head out for business. There's this restaurant I frequent. The geisha there have been having some trouble lately. One has to lend a helping hand when one can, you know? It's all about Ejiri, so a bit of a trek, but you want to come too? Sure, why not? Ha! Huh. I thought you were looking bored. Well then, by all means, let's be off. As soon as the gang leaders disappeared, they were replaced by corrupt officials. Picking fights at post stations, harassing geishas, things really have gotten out of control. Mr. Takazuki, thank you for coming. Just a moment while I prepare refreshments. Don't waste your time. Those officials, they still giving you trouble? Yes. They came again last night, made a mess of the place, then left without paying. They're running the business into the ground. <sighs> and they presume to run the country. And what of the man I sent ahead? Ito? He's gone to investigate the officials in question. Please. You must help us. There's no one else we can turn to. I will do what I can, but it will likely be just this once. I don't exactly have a lot of free time, I'm afraid. Having heard the dilemma? You'll help too, then. First off, let's meet up with Ito. Who's Ito? You don't remember? He attacked the British legation with us. I'm sure you'll recognize him. Come on, let's go. Mr. Takasugi doesn't quite seem himself. I do hope he's all right. We, all of us here, are very fond of him. You take good care of him for us, won't you? I hope that fool, Ito, hasn't made a mistake. Let's check on the map where he's at. Oh, hey, we're back at that one area, the checkpoint. Oh, we can't get up there anyways. Oh? Well. <laughs> Yeah, some of those officials now. Damn it. Hey, this isn't the time to die. All right? Yeah, no, no, it's not. Kasuki, you had me worried. Oh, you came too. How encouraging. Those nasty officials are at their base. All we have to do is storm it. Let's go. Yeah, it doesn't look like it's turning out very good for the anti-shogunate.
says help the townspeople, but I don't know. I, I guess this is how we help them. I, I don't really know. Intruders. All right, Kimenzan. We're out there. Oh. The casters. This is bashing their heads in. What kind of vertical cut is this? care of that I'm a bit tired I would head on back to the restaurant hey wait you can't just go by yourself I'm coming too okay that's twice now I did not get the optional thing where am I going up top here, I guess. How the hell do you get up there? What the hell? <laughs> I'm so confused right now. Says that I'm leaving the area, but I, I just want to get up to the top, man. Oh, there's the stairs. Man, it's really depressing with the anti-shogunate. Anti Everybody's dying or just depressed. Good work back there. Everything went smoothly, thanks to you. But these corrupt officials are as common as rats. We would run ourselves ragged if we tried to deal with each and every one of them. This lot seemed worse than the officials in Chinatown. No, I would say they were just as bad. It exceeds a petty crime having merchants peddle stolen goods. In any case, it's always the common folk who suffer. Still, they are not completely powerless. This incident should have shown the people of Ejiri that they don't need to fear the authorities. Same for those in Chinatown. By uniting under a common purpose, they can strike back at their oppressors. Now more than ever, I see the truth in Master showing words. If he were to overthrow the shogunate and save Japan, the masters must... <coughs> Are you going to be all right? It's nothing. I got a little carried away. That's all. I'm all fine now, so don't worry. <clears throat> Just keep this between us. 
All right. I have a feeling he's got cholera. That's sad. Just waiting for the pop-ups to finish here. So annoying. Let me just sift through every single freaking thing. Oh, we got, we got to get bond up with a lot of people. I'm going to obviously do that off recording. And then Edo, I, I don't know. I don't know what we're doing with that. I guess we can go back to Edo. I don't know. I'm going to be getting my bond up off recording and I'm going to get all of Kyoto explored and everything. Let's see what this merchant has real quick. Do you have a browse? I would love to. I've procured some fine wares. No. Thank you very much. Definitely love buying these gifts every time I find them. Please, come again. Let's see what Ryoma wants us to do. Look. Seems he was some kind of shogunate big shot. Did you know him? No. But look at how he's been killed. Stabbed right in the throat. He's always handiwork if ever I saw it. His hideout must be close by. I'm sure of it. Probably that abandoned temple. Will you help me put a stop to Izo's madness? Izo, he's the man who tried to attack Katsu, right? Yes, him. Seems he hasn't changed at all. Unfortunately, sometimes friends take a wrong path. Let's go do let's go deal with this. Let's wait until dark. He's sure to come crawling back to his hidey hole then. Right, let's go. You remember what Katsu told us. To those who oppose the Shogunate, killings like those are divine punishment. How is this country supposed to contend with the Westerners when our own people endlessly slaughter one another? I still don't know exactly what the new Japan will look like. But one thing is certain. We'll never get anywhere if we keep fighting like this amongst ourselves. How long has it been since we first crossed paths? Since we met, so many people have died. And more than a few by our own hands. Even Genzui is gone, leaving us with a whole other conflict on our hands. He could have changed the Japan. He was made of the right stuff. We're here. Let's look for you all.
Take a look at this. A bullet. I don't know any enemy of the Shogunate who would use a pistol. This has to belong to Izo. I don't think he's here now. But if we wait long enough... <sighs> I've been thinking for a while. About what Master Shoin wanted us to do. Kenzui and Izo both claim to have taken on Master Shoin's mantle. But, well, you know how that's turned out. But I haven't taken the same path as them. Why do you think that is? I don't know. You've changed alongside the company you keep, I guess? The true difference is that I've met people worth listening to, who've given me the chance to change and move forward. I'm lucky to have you and Katsu. Thank you. From the bottom of my heart. If I hadn't met you in that cave in Yokohama, I might have ended up like Izo. Well, I'm happy to have met you too, Ryoma. <laughs> That's music to my ears. Now I'm ready for anything. I just can't imagine my life if we hadn't met. <laughs> <clears throat> anyway, seems like he's all still isn't back. You should grab some sleep. I'll wake you when he comes. Where's Ryoma? And it's raining. Oh, they better not kill off Ryoma. He's such a good character. I knew it. If Ryoma came, I knew you'd be with him. The world is supposed to change if I just keep getting... But how much longer? How much more do I have to do this? I wonder... Would it make me feel better to kill you? Oh my god, this guy! Holy shit! Dude's not fucking around. I can't fucking move. Maybe I could be like Ryoma, too. 
Okay, can I fucking heal? Nope. That was fucking lame. But what now? What? Still cannot get his fucking grapple attack down. Dude, that fucking grapple attack sucks, man. Am I gonna die again? Are you fucking serious? Of course, you can rest assured I'll do that. More blood will be shed on this land. Keep Ryoma safe with your blade, lest he suffer my fate. I'm sorry I left you. I wanted to be the one to settle things with Izo. And I really didn't want you to have to dirty your hands. But you had to step in and save the day anyway.
I honestly thought you were a goner there for a second. Come on. He just got one lucky hit in. <laughs> That's all. Let me bury Yizo alone. I think it's what he would have wanted. You should head back first. Let's see. Where's our next bond mission? Right there? Oh, way over there. Holy moly. We'll have to ride our horse over there. If we even have enough time, that is. I'm not sure we will have enough time. We got just a little more than 10 minutes left in the video. Uh, let's look at our equipment. Clear-headed samurai? What's that do? I mean, it's not bad, but it also plays off of you being, um, you having a lot of health. Mighty Warrior, in my opinion, is much better. We're going to lock that. Yeah, I don't see anything better there. Yeah, I think I'm going to get rid of the Samurai stuff. Or not, did I say samurai? I meant uh, the, what's it called? Shinobi stuff. <laughs> I was looking at samurai and I was like, oh, what was I doing again? Mighty warrior. Plus two to strength. Oh, my attack goes up as my health goes down. That's good. Guarding takes less key. Really good. And then damage taken is down. Yeah, Mighty Warrior seems like a good one. I have to look at some of that stuff as we are off recording. God, man, I cannot talk today. I'm just, there's a lot going on, so I'm kind of lost for words. We don't have any, well, we have a longhouse we can fast travel to. It'll make for a shorter ride. So maybe we'll just fast travel over here right over here and then end the video and when we come back we'll do the wolves of mibu i'm so dumb just said we were gonna fast travel and then i did the opposite and then when we come back i'll have all of kyoto explored and taken care of send my dog on a pilgrimage <laughs> and we may have some new gear when I come back too. I don't know. We'll see. Oh yeah, it's super far. But I think we just got to ride straight down this road for the most part. Or well, take a left and take a right. 
then take a left. Duh! Take a left. Take a right. And then take a left. Right here. See if I went the right way. I did. Awesome. We can light this veiled edge banner. Okay, before we go any further, I think this is a good spot to end the video. Let's get out of the way of the marker, though. The way it's not covering up my face. All right, everybody. I want to start by telling you all thank you so very much for stopping by and watching the video. It really does mean the world to me. Hopefully you all enjoyed it. If you did, go ahead and hit that thumbs up button. If you didn't, hit the thumbs down button. Let me know why down in the comments below. It only helps the channel. Also, if you enjoy content just like this, be sure to subscribe or don't. I don't know. I'm not your dad. Do whatever you want. And like always, everybody, have a good morning, a good afternoon, or a good night. Whatever time it may be in your part of the world. Mr. John Wayne, signing off.